Hi, this is Deepen Gogoi, Technical Analyst of Allies Blue. Uh, so here you can see this is a 4 hour chart and this is the crude oil. And according to the moving average, so here we can see the crude oil is running in a downtrend. Have you seen this is a 200 moving average, 150 moving average, and the 100 moving average, 50 moving average, and 20 and 7. All are exponential moving average. So here we can see the moving average are arranging in a sequence right so you can see this is 200 is above and the lower is below so when moving ever is uh, running like that we are confirmed that the trend is down right remember so uh, law is that if trend is down we never gonna buy right we have to wait a sell signal now uh, where is our entry point? Now you can see here according to the candlestick pattern. So here you can see candlestick pattern here. They are forming a dozy pattern, right? You can see it's a dozy pattern or some people are called like inverted hammer, right? So previously they are forming here. You can see this is uh, inverted hammer or dozy pattern. So at that time I told that if you want to sell it, so you just place sell order just to uh, around the uh, 5 to 10 point below this candlestick pattern right so the logic is that candlestick pattern uh, the candle should be appear in a right place now you can see is this candle is placing in the right place uh, forming in the right place definitely yes so that means uh, trend is down right and uh, we are looking for a bearish candle right so here you can see this is a bearish candle. Now, what is our entry point? This is the big question. So that is why I want to draw a horizontal line. So have you seen this is a bearish candle? I just place a just a little more here. I can see here. Just let me check it. Yeah, a little more here around uh, 3880 or oh, a little more below. Right so once they break this level definitely we will go for sell right this is our uh, supporting area according to uh, sorry not supporting this is our anti point right so this if this is our anti point then where is our target so here you can see we have seen this is a previous supporting point around uh, 3780 right if you see the previous market behavior so here we can see this is uh, this was our bearish sell signal right candlestick pattern so we place just below here sell order right have you seen we place just below the sell order and here was sl but you can see we have seen sl is too big right around uh, 70 80 point so i'll discuss how to uh, do the position sizing right so i'll discuss about that one so you can see the price here was our entry point and now you can see and SL was here but here you can see the price was trigger here sell order right price never comes below this candle right price gone up again after that they are forming another sell uh, bearish candlestick pattern for the sell right so that is why we have placed a sell order here now you can see uh, this is our uh, SL. So now you can see SL is too big, right? So if SL is too big, so how we how we'll do the position sizing, right? So let me explain how to do the position sizing. Uh, let me check it here. Now you can see we have seen our SL is there and our entry point here. It's just showing almost a 90 point, and that is a too big, right? So that is why we can't uh, keep SL uh, that much, like. So that is why you can see in a small time frame like 15 minutes. So here we can see we have seen this is a 15 minute time frame and the price is running like that. Right, price is running like that. So we can see this is a higher point. So after that price just fell down and here is a creating a higher low. And if price break this level, so we know that uh, this is our entry point uh, for the sell in this area, right? This is our sell point below this area, remember, below this area right in a four hour chart we have seen this type of uh, hammer uh, inverted hammer and uh, we are placing sell order that means uh, below this hammer and uh, that sell order will be here around 
3 h 7 by right remember so now see uh, here we can see this is the previous higher point so if you want to enter for the cell here so we will keep our sl here just above this area so let me tell you this is our sl point suppose right so we place sl so in that case we can see our sl point will be around uh, 30 to 40 50 point so so you can see this is our 50 point our uh, sl right so how you will do the position sizing what is the formula behind that one now you can see the po uh, position uh, sizing formula is that uh, so number of lot so how many lot we're gonna buy right so you can see uh, percentage of uh, risk part rate suppose if you wanna take uh, risk uh, around uh, suppose two percent right so two percent here right into total capital suppose we have sorry uh, one uh, one let right so let me tell you so i'll show you one let and uh, divided by risk per lot so suppose we are we want to take 50 point risk into uh, value which is uh, small crude oil mini so uh, 10 point right so now you can see here that means we place sl here 50 point above that means this is a distance of uh, 50 point right uh, this one uh, this is our sl stop loss and this is our anti right this is our anti uh, anti point is this one right to tell uh, capital we have one leg right to tell capital ha we have one leg and we're gonna take entire two percent risk right so that cal uh, let me calculate how many lot we can buy if you wanna take uh, that much of risk so you can see two uh, two percent divided by 100 right into one leg is equal to you can see 2000 and now you can see this is a 2000 so that means we uh, in above we can see here that means here like that it will be 2000 right and next you can see here uh, let me clear this one and lower one uh, 50 into 10 you can see 500 that means here will be 500 right it will be 500 and then now you can see how many lot we can buy right and here we can see 2000 divided by 500 so we can buy here for lot mini right so now you can see in this area by doing the money management and position sizing we can buy only four lot right means you can buy four lot you can buy four lot not more than that means if you're gonna buy here four lot so we're gonna take only uh two percent risk two percent risk entire our capital so our target will be here right so if you want to see uh, the target and here you can see our sl will be here around the 50 point and our target is here so you can see 90 point so almost our trading ratio will be 1 is to 2 not exactly 1 is to 2 so almost 1 is to 1 point 1 point 8 our trading ratio so that means if you wanna uh law if you are if we lost one percent so we will earn 1.8 percent right and our profit right so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.